Hey guys, what is up? Finn here once again, bringing you a third redstone tutorial. And today we're going to be making a really easy TNT cannon that reloads itself without you even having to place any TNT. So you're going to want 13 block of your choice, one slab, eight dispensers, eight repeaters, 11 redstone, a button, and then of course some TNT. So first of all, you're going to want to place three of the block of your choice and put a button in the middle. Oh. Actually, I need water as well, but we'll get that later. And um, then you're going to want to place your dispensers. But well, you're going to want to place another block of your choice there, and then your dispensers like this. So that you've only got one left. Then you're going to want to place all of the block that you chose like this. The slab there. And you're going to want this dispenser up here. And so then you're going to want to place up all your redstone. Sorry, not there. And then, yep, you want to put it on top of these dispensers. Like so. Oh. Yeah, actually, that's all I need. So then you're going to need your repeaters here. Put them all to three ticks, just so that the cannon flies the furthest possible. Or I think that might be considered four ticks, I'm not too sure. But yeah, I just quickly grab myself some, um, some water. I forgot about that completely. Um, so yeah, you're going to want to place your water bucket here and then you're going to want to split your stacks of TNT up depending on how much you've got I'm splitting them up just because I had three stacks so now you're going to want to put a, put, bit, bunch, put a bunch of it into each dispenser like so, how long did I just miss one? I didn't um, in this one and finally in this one and then you're done already so you're going to want to press this button it will put in the TNT and it will put that one in and off it goes, I went pretty far too far for us even to see, you can see it way over there it's exploded um, a good thing about this thing that reloads itself is you can just sort of go like this and then keep doing it like this and get the sort of fire kind of cannon, you see. Like when you do that, it doesn't go anywhere near that far. But, um, you know, some of them did go quite far. You can see two of them are way over there that went really far. A couple of them weren't the best, like this one. But it is a quick, easy to build, not too resource heavy. You're just going to need a lot of bows for your dispensers and a little bit of redstone as well. Um, but yeah, other than that, it's quite easy. Um, I've been Finn. This has been my redstone cannon that you don't have to place any TNT for a tutorial. And I'll see you guys next time.